Now that the mold's all done, it's time to get the epoxy poured. I'm using some Total Boat Thick Set here, introducing some pigments, and unfortunately the store only had a five gallon bucket mixer. They didn't have just a regular paddle mixer, so that's what I had to use. It definitely introduced a few too many bubbles into the epoxy, but we ended up working it out. I definitely think it's super satisfying to see the epoxy go in through here and fill up the cracks in the wood, and definitely cool to see everything settled in. I did end up pouring over the entire piece, but I wanted to do this a little bit slower to make sure that we tried to evacuate as much of the air out of the cracks as possible. So we went through there and got everything done and everything poured. Using a reciprocating saw without a blade, I was able to vibrate the mold a little bit, and it was really cool to see the epoxy move within the cracks of the wood. So bubbles started to form, and one of the best ways to remove those is just using a propane torch. It's really satisfying to see that propane torch popping those bubbles. We've got to let this set up for a few days, but we'll get back to this on the next video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, everybody.